Yeah, I think it's uh, G3 YPZ. Uh, G3, yeah, it's John there. Okay. Finally meet up with you, John. G3 Yankee Papa Zulu. G3 G uh, or YPZ. I've seen a lot of your videos. Uh, this is Whiskey Baker 9 Delta Zulu Sierra. My name's Tom. Tokyo Ocean, Mexico. The name here is Tom, Tokyo Ocean, Mexico. I'm located in Chesterfield, Virginia. Chesterfield in the state of Virginia, 10 miles south of uh, Richmond, Virginia. We're about 100 kilometers south of Washington, D.C., uh, John. Uh, signal's a little light. Uh, we'll play with the antennas, uh, but uh, I do copy. Uh, G3 Yankee Papa Zulu from Whiskey Bravo 9 Delta Zulu Sierra. Go ahead. Yeah, copy much better now. Uh, Golf 3 Yankee Papa Zulu from Whiskey Bravo 9 Delta Zulu Sierra. Uh, fine business being on the uh, East Coast with your quad and your ICOM IC7300. Uh, your antenna's doing all the work. Uh, you're only S3 peaking S4. S3 to S4, of course the noise floor is uh, very low here. Uh, my equipment is a Flex 5000A. A Flex 5000A, I'm driving that with about 11 watts to a expert, an Italian uh, expert amplifier, a uh, 1.5 KFA running legal limit but my antenna is just a off-center fed dipole it's a I'm now using the uh, carolina windham 160 multi-band 160 through six meter off-center fed dipole and it's up at uh, about 20 meters uh, 20 meters above the ground at the apex it's in in an inverted V configuration. So I am recording the video. I'll post it on the uh, uh, the AM forums or and YouTube uh, here, and uh, you'll be able to see how you were coming in here. But your uh, 7300s making it. I had to narrow my filter a little bit. I had my uh, TX filter at 10 uh, kilohertz, and I narrowed it down to. 6.6 uh, .6 kilohertz and then I was able to copy you uh, much better with a little uh, more narrow uh, filter there uh, John but I've been looking forward to I've been seeing you chatting with you on Facebook but I don't believe we've ever worked before so uh, it's nice to catch you on uh, on 15 meters a.m. I was kind of hoping uh, somebody like you was we're going to be around today. I uh, tried 10 meters yesterday uh, with no success. 
Uh, back over to you, uh, John. G3, Yankee Papa Zulu on the east coast of England. Uh, this is Whiskey Bravo 9, Delta Zulu Sierra. Go ahead, John. Roger, Roger, I, I caught it all uh, there. He said there is some QSB, but uh, your signal held out between a S3 to an S4. And uh, we, we uh, uh, a G3 YPZ, WB9DZS. I've just been on uh, AM mostly uh, between uh, starting, I think, about 2017, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, where we got active on AM. I, I, my first amateur radio contact, I believe, was on AM on, a, on 160 meters uh, back in 1970 when I converted a, a new old stock uh, ARC-5 uh, Navy uh, military surplus. And uh, that, that was, I think, a little lower. I had to trim the, the coil a little bit and make a couple mods, but I got on a, a 160 meters uh, AM and worked a few stations around. At that time, uh, I, I think I took out pretty much channel two. Uh, I lived uh, south, uh, about 50 miles southeast of Chicago in Indiana. And it took out the uh, Chicago Channel 2 uh, CBS station when I when I got on uh, uh, AM, so that didn't last long. And then I I built a Heathkit HW100 after that, and uh, got on the air. And uh, uh, I actually converted the HW100 to H, uh, AM as well, uh, and made a few a AM contacts. But I w really wasn't very active on AM. AM is now my uh, uh, my favorite mode. My most common mode is the slow scan TV because uh, my health condition has uh, affected my voice. It's hard to talk and hard to breathe if I, I talk too long. Uh, but it's sure a pleasure. I've been, uh, my goal has been to, to find you either here on 15 or, or 10 meters or some other band because I, I, I very much uh, uh, very much enjoy your uh, your videos that you post. We're in the same, I think, the AM Classic and the AM Modulation groups on uh, on uh, Facebook, and I uh, I, I always uh, love to see your your uh, your posts, especially of your uh, the the AM contacts up here on 15. Uh, so very good uh, on that. Uh, so uh, anyhow, uh, I've been switching antennas. I'm now on the uh, Carolina Wyndham 80. I have two Carolina Wyndhams, a 160 and an 80, uh, that are about uh, uh, 50 meters apart, uh, both in a similar configuration and height. Uh, uh, so it, it, it probably depends on the QSB, which one is working better. I won't hold you. I can't talk very long anyhow. So I'll uh, 
in a little bit. Uh, if you look on the uh, AM Classic or AM Modulation Groups, I'll post a link uh, to Facebook, or you could go directly or to, uh, to YouTube and search your call sign or my call sign, and uh, you'll see the link there. So I'll, I'll post that to Facebook and copy the link, or uh, to YouTube and copy the links to Facebook here, here right after this QSO. So I will pass along my 73s. My voice is giving out, but uh, a very enjoyable QSO, uh, very gratifying for me finally to get to work here on 15 meters. George 3, Yankee Papa, Zulu, Whiskey Bravo 9 Delta, Zulu Sierra, in Chesterfield, Virginia, signing clear, listening for any final comments. John, go ahead. Roger that, John. Uh, it's uh, it it uh, as you say, there was a, a lot of QSB, especially to the beginning. I did miss uh, some of that in the beginning. I switched back and forth on antennas, uh, John, and <clears throat> you, you came back up uh, uh, to where it was very copyable uh, toward the end. And uh, yeah, you got you got to ham radio one year before me. I think I was licensed in about May of 1970. I was very active uh, on uh, shortwave listening uh, probably from the mid mid 1960s on and that's what actually got me interested in the ham radio. Started running out of uh, countries uh, uh, from commercial broadcast stations and started listening more and more into the amateur radio bands and that drove my uh, my interest and uh, met up with a local ham who was on 160 AM and he was my Elmer. He was a, a blind ham from Crown Point, Indiana, W9PBS, uh, John Miller. And he, uh, I think he was the president of the uh, Blind uh, Brass Keek uh, Club or, uh, uh, the, yeah, I forgot what they call it, but the CW. Uh, for uh, the blind, amateur radio blind. He, he became my Elmer. Uh, 73, John, uh, we'll look forward to talking to you under better band conditions. Maybe we've heard a lot of uh, Europeans coming in on 10 meters lately. <clears throat> so maybe we'll be able to hook up with you on, on uh, 2900 uh, sometime. G3 Yankee Papa Zulu. WB9 Delta Zulu Sugar is off and clear 73 and have a good afternoon.